It's a big upcoming week for the Blue and Gold, highlighted with multiple home games, the start of conference play, and some contests against bitter rivals. I'm Griffin Delapena reporting for GoGriffs.com, and this is this week's edition of Around Canisius Athletics, presented by Niagara Scenic Tours. It was the first road non-conference victory for the women's basketball program since 2018, last Tuesday against Colgate. The Griffs got the lead in the first minute and did not let up for the remainder of the contest against the Raiders. Danny Haskell led all scores with 20 points, including going four for seven from beyond the arc. After their loss against Robert Morris, they will now come back here to the Kessler Athletic Center to host UAlbany on Wednesday for Mental Health Awareness Night. It was a split for the Canisius hockey team this past weekend against Army, as they had a shootout win on Friday. However, they did lose 3-1 on Saturday, with Stefano Botini scoring his first collegiate goal. They'll now have a home-and-home -home series against RIT, who currently has a conference-best 9-1 record in Atlantic hockey. The men's basketball team started their seven-game road trip this last week and dropped both games against Cornell and UB. Jordan Henderson dropped a game-high 24 points on Tuesday against the Big Red, and Jameer Moultrie added 17 points in the loss against the Bulls. They'll now start their conference slate on Friday at Siena and on Sunday against Iona. After setting 10 program records at the Magnus Invite, the Swim and Dive team will travel to Olean to face St. Bonaventure on Saturday. Make sure to purchase your tickets now for Wednesday's women's basketball game and Saturday's home hockey game at Lecom Harbor Center. Wrapping this episode up for Around Canisius Athletics, I'm Griffin Delapena, and as always, go Griffs.